Hey everyone, Cody here. And today I wanna to kind of address a question that's kind of related to some of the other questions I've been asked before. And that's, is it cheaper to stretch your own canvas? Um, and I and I also kind of wanna cover, I have a note here. So um, not only cheaper, but easier. So let's talk about kind of both aspects. So is it cheaper to stretch your own canvas? Basically what people are asking, if you don't understand is, you know, you can buy canvas that's just on a roll, that's flat, just the material, and then, you know, you put it on a frame yourself, right? So you either uh, have someone just make you a frame or you buy the stretcher bars and the framing bars and then you put it all together and then you stretch it over that. Um, so let's talk about that. So cheaper, no, probably not. Almost, it is almost always easier to just buy a canvas that is already put together. Not always, but generally speaking, it is easier or cheaper to buy just an already stretched canvas. Like it is cheaper for me to um, just buy like this. I have a canvas in front of me that's like four foot by five foot. And normally that, that canvas is like a hundred dollars or something like that. And if I were to go buy the materials to, you know, the actual canvas and then the frame and then the materials to actually put that together with like nails and stuff like that, um, actually it would probably come out more. The only caveat there is that you can kind of get discounts on some of that stuff. So maybe you can get the canvas cheap. So you can get a big roll for a decent price um, or you can get the stretcher bars on sale or something like that. But but generally it's, it's usually just cheaper to buy the canvas, especially considering if you get it on sale. So like I get a lot of my canvas from Michaels because Michaels usually does amazing sales where they'll do like 70% off canvas, which they do multiple times a year. So I'll stock up on canvas when they run those sales because I can buy a large canvas like that that's normally like 100 to $150 for like 30. So it's it's really a really good price. So when you consider that, then you know it's way cheaper to do that. Now, let's talk about easier. Obviously, if you're already buying something that's already pre-constructed, then yes. Um, you know, it's going to be cheaper because you're already buying the frame already, you know, put together. You don't have to stretch that out. You don't have to, you know, cut the lengths and you don't have to, you know, put all that together a lot. You know, everything is already done for you. So no, it's not generally cheaper or easier to buy unrolled, uh, you know, rolled or unstretched canvas. It, it just generally isn't. The caveat, or I would say the, the thing about buying uh, rolled canvas and then maybe stretching it yourself. The I will say the one upside, and I've talked about this before, is storage. So if you buy just the raw canvas, uh, you can actually just paint the painting on the canvas, and then you could just store the canvas by itself, like in a shipping tube or just wrapped in glass lined paper or something. And you can just ship that, or I mean, sorry, you can store that somewhere. And it's very easy to store. In fact, you could have, you could put a whole stack of them together because they don't take up that much room. And then you could just frame it before you ship that painting out. There, you know, there's not really a waiting period that needs to happen before, you know, the thing is done and dried and rolled up to when it goes on the frame. <clears throat> Once you sell that painting, you could just put it over the frame and ship it out. Like it's very easy. So I will say that the, as far as storage goes, it is easier to store just paintings that are just on the canvas and not already stretched. Um, but it is a good uh, thing to learn. if Like learn that skill of, of kind of stretching and stuff. It is like a skill that you could use for yourself or even for others. You could charge other artists who don't want to, you know, stretch their paintings over frames. You could actually charge for that service because it's not something that everybody can do. I'm not very good at it. So I actually just buy them, stretch, or I sell the paintings just on the canvas itself as opposed to stretching them myself. So ultimately, I hope that answers that question. No, it's generally not cheaper or easier to um, paint on unstretched canvas and then stretch it yourself. So hopefully that helps answer that question. Um, if you have any other questions, you can leave them in the comment section below. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like it or consider subscribing. But that's pretty much it. I will catch you guys in the next video. Take care. God bless and see you then. Bye, guys.